Welcome back. Today we are talking about whether or not we think it's worth it to get the Ryobi 18 inch hybrid air cannon drum fan, the P3340. Stay tuned. And again, if you haven't seen our box opening video, we'll go ahead and link it up here. Take a look at the uh, opening. We go through some of the features and uh, benefits of this particular fan. But today, we've had a lot of comments or questions about whether or not it's actually worth it. This is a very expensive drum fan. If you look online, you can find a similar 18 inch fan for a lot less. So is it worth it or do we think that it's worth it to get this fan? So let's start with just the practical airflow comparison to a, a similar fan. There's not much of a difference. Now, as far as quality goes, that's where you could argue, yes, you're getting a metal drum, you're getting metal legs, the rear guard, is all metal. There is still a lot of plastic, the plastic handle on top, which while it's nice and big, it does, it is sharp and cuts into your hand a little bit. Plastic front guard, the plastic sides, and uh, plastic feet on the bottom, and the battery compartment on the back is also all plastic there. Quality wise, that's definitely a plus. I would say it's more valuable than the plastic counterparts. Next up, let's talk about the included cord. Now it's a four foot cord that's included. So it's not very long, but if you don't like this cord or if you want a longer cord, go grab any extension cord and it will plug right in and plug into whatever you need. So again, this isn't a super long uh, cord. You'll probably find longer cords. Any other fan's gonna be longer, but another plus goes to this one that it's customizable. You can grab any power cord and you can have a 20 foot or a 50 foot. A couple things that are similar to all other fans. It is completely adjustable. You can spin it nearly all the way around. That's pretty standard. Uh, most are going to have some kind of mounting or some kind of way to hook them up. This one does have a mounting bracket on the bottom. So that's, that's nice. And the biggest thing, the biggest reason that this fan is a step above any of the others is the hybrid ability. So in addition to having the power cord adapter there, take that out, plug in the battery, and now we're good to go. So just a quick comment on the runtime with the standard battery in the highest mode, there's three modes, in the highest mode we were able to get to just over an hour and a half runtime. So not too bad, but an hour and a half with a four amp hour battery means that you're really not going to get all day runtime with this. You're going to need to have multiple batteries. So that's something to consider. So for our evaluation, our opinion of whether or not this fan is worth the dollar versus the counterparts. And in our opinion, probably not. In most cases, this is probably not the best option for most buyers. At this price point, there are a lot of other options. Now, if you have to have the hybrid battery mode, then absolutely, this obviously is, is what you need. Better have a lot of batteries if you need all day runtime. But again, at this price point, it is just not really reasonable or feasible for most people that just need an 18 inch fan. Now, that's not to say that we don't love this fan. In fact, since we've purchased this fan, it's been run nearly nonstop. We've had it plugged into the wall, had it running almost all day, almost all night, constantly running. So yes, we love it. It's awesome. We love the color scheme. We love the fact that it's hybrid. We love everything about this fan, except for the price. So guys, that being said, it is an 
awesome fan in our opinion, but the price is one thing that's going to keep a lot of people away from this fan. Well, because of the other options, because you can buy cheaper fans, there's just not really a good justification, again, unless you need that battery power. Now, where I live, we have a hurricane headed this way and power could go out. So being able to use the batteries is great. But again, at one and a half hours, I've gotta have a lot of batteries charged up and ready to go, or I'm still out of luck. So just another thing to consider, guys, it is an awesome addition to your collection. If you have the budget, if you have the, the extra money to, to put towards a fan like this, awesome but for most people, probably better off getting any other 18 inch fan. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you're into that. Make sure to check out the links in the description below and comment to let us know what tool you want to see next. Thanks for watching guys. It's like Christmas day here, we have both of the Ryobi garage door openers and all of the currently available mods for these garage door openers. Obviously we can't break down all of these in one video, so we will be doing a little mini series where we open and review each one of these. But make sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of the future videos. Geese. All riled up. The, again, the feet. Ooh. Getting that Florida thunder. Um, it's just a little. Getting all kinds of noise today. <laughs> I can't get my finger in there. Uh, yes, definitely plastic.